All right, so this is everything that we have from the store today. Traded in the old hopper and 50 bucks for the no no sorry the new the old hopper and 40 bucks for the Empire um, Prophecy. All right, super fast hopper will feed anything. Bought a tank for it. Uh, it's the 70 4500 uh, pure energy, nicest tank you can get for it. The freak kit. All right. That is a bunch of decals and stuff that will go uh, on the setup once it's completed. Uh, I got that's my old uh, freak. That's for the freak backs. Um, new as new ASA mini gauge, old reg, uh, new grips, uh, the uh, horn, uh, the thorn drop, virtue board, and all the backs for the freak for the freaks there. And now let's take a look at the gun. So I'm gonna sit the uh, the case down there, and uh, this is uh, the unveiling of the gun itself. Oh yeah, and there's the old uh, feet neck for it too. All right, so looking down at it, we have the freak front, the quick lock feet neck, new grips and a virtue. Uh, there's an HE bolt in there, uh, new drop, new ASA. The old reg, but it's actually brand new. It's a new die reg, and I really like that. I was going to throw a CP on there, but after I put them both on and see how it shot, was definitely this one. New gauge. There's the freak again with all the inserts, and uh, that's pretty much it. It it uh, it can't really be upgraded anymore. Um, like I said, I told you about the trigger in the back piece there, and uh, we're going to see what it shoots. So I got some uh, reballs that we're going to uh, shoot at and let you guys see how it fires. This is it with uh, all the parts on it, the new hopper and the uh, new tank, and I must say it looks spectacular uh, with the freak and the freak silver insert with the red tip, HE bolt, uh, new quick lock feed neck, new mini gauge, new CPASA, new uh, 70-4500 pure energy, new drop, new grips, new virtue, new virtue eyes, uh, the prophecy new board. Um, I left the original trigger in there, but uh, this thing is, it's amazing, and it just looks so sweet with the virtue in it, and um, I want to uh, turn the eyes off, because uh, this is reballs, we're going to be using reballs, and reballs and virtue eyes, I don't know if you guys know this, but they do not mix together. Sometimes virtue eyes have big problems with reballs, and uh, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to dump a, uh, a pot in for you guys. It's set right now at 18 BPS. At the store, we were totally impressing people. We had it shooting 26 BPS, no problem. We could have turned it, for, we could have turned it up further, but we were short on time, and uh, the store was getting ready to close and stuff. So I stayed there for like three or four hours, I just talking, and people were shooting the gun and stuff. They just they loved it. And um, so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to air it up for you guys. And it is so solid. I don't know if you guys can hear... No leaks at all. It's, it's so solid. And um, it is just, it, it's great. It really is, it, it really is just great. And I'm going to, I'm going to just, it's on um, 18 BPS ramping right now. So I'm going to just go ahead and fire one and uh, let you guys see that uh, it shoots just fine. Now I just want you guys to know with the reballs, uh, it's hard to shoot full on and ramping with reballs when you have the virtue eyes off because uh, I would go outside and shoot some real paint through, but we're in a massive thunderstorm right now. But uh, this is uh, a, a, around what it will be like. And as you can see, it, it rips so hard. Like, you don't even know how hard this thing rips. It is... Uh, it rips... It rips wicked hard, and uh, I love this new feature on the Prophecy. I don't know, hold on. So I gotta make sure there's no balls on the hop before I do this. It's a instead of using the rip drive, it's an, a rip button. You push it, and it just rips through. One, you just like so, because I know sometimes it's hard to get up there and try to flick this. All you gotta do is just rip drive, and then keep firing. It is. It is 
a magnificent gun. And uh, <laughs> I know you guys are asking probably the same, everyone always asks the same question. Why not just take all that money and just buy a nicer gun? Because for me, it's not all about buying a nicer gun. It's all about buying a gun that I just love to use. And this thing is, you can't deck it out anymore. And it looks beautiful. You can't deck it out anymore. It looks beautiful. It's an SFT shocker. It looks beautiful. And these things are so nice. And even the new hoppers are so nice. You can do all kinds of sweet stuff with them. If you take the uh, take the front off. Sorry, my girl's videotaping. Thanks, babe. You can take the front off of these. Well, I don't know if you can take it off while it's in or not. I guess you can't take it off while it's in the thing. But these slide off and you can put new nose cans and stuff on there. And it's just an amazing gun. I'm going to turn the air off. Let the air out. And uh, it's just amazing. It's an amazing setup. And thank you, Jordan. Uh, I guarantee you, you probably are a little bit jealous right now because uh, you're the one that sold me this shocker. I got it for 200 bucks, And I put about 550 into it. And uh, it's amazing. It, uh, it really is amazing. And I, and I guarantee this will be something I would never let go unless someone traded me something super sweet for it. And so I'm, that's one thing I'm about getting into doing right now is uh, buying uh, guns like this and then just, just decking them out completely. Uh, it was a fun project to do, and everyone down at the shop loved it, and uh, it, it, it performs amazing. It really does perform amazing. And also, it's going to have a, a new trigger, but I think I might stick with this one because I really like it. You, you, can, you can hit from the side and from the front. So you can hit from the front and from the side, and it still shoots. And c some of the newer CP triggers are harder to do that because they're thicker, but this one is just amazing. And I might get a new uh, hybrid uh, back for it. But other than that, it's amazing. And uh, I just hope you guys comment on it. And uh, it'll be on PB Nation, just in case that someone puts a great offer up for it. And uh, it, it would really have to be a great offer. But it, it's an amazing gun. There it is. Shocker. Decked out.